Hello, Rwanda for peoples. Look who's back in Rwanda. Hey, how you doing? Doing fine. So in today's video, we're just gonna have a random vlog of doing something in uh, Kigali with my girlfriend right here. We're going into town to go visit the IKEA of Rwanda. If you're from Rwanda, you know which store I'm talking about, right? Then after that, we're gonna maybe travel around to scout some new locations for, uh, for the gym. And uh, yeah, take you along with me. All right, let's get this vlog started. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. All right. So I recently got myself a scooter, which is pretty handy actually. After I had borrowed one from a client who went on a vacation, I realized how much I needed it actually. Especially in these COVID times where we need to keep our hygiene up and keep our social distancing, it's good to have your own transportation. And also it's good when you have a, when you have a visitor uh, to, to be able to move at your own pace uh, in your own time. This is the city center, not as busy as I'm used to it. And guys, this is what I'm talking about. All black everything. Where I grew up, there were never such a big posters with black people on them. Just love it. And then this happened. Okay. The is closed, so we're just gonna be wandering around. And now we're getting a new uh, screen protector. Oh wow, perfectly done. Hello guys. So, it's now uh, two days later. We went to town, uh, we found out everything's closed on a Sunday. Mm. So, uh, yeah, we changed plans. We went to this like uh, marketplace to go eat some uh, snacks, some vegan sambusas and uh, fries and stuff. And after that, we decided to go surprise her cousin with a visit, uh, just randomly. Mm -hmm. And yeah. a surprise it was. She was crying and she didn't know we were coming but we just happened to be in the neighborhood and, and that's where we spent the rest of the days and then we just you know, came home. So now it's on a Tuesday, we're going to attempt to go back to the IKEA of Rwanda, aka Tour de Mille, to go buy some, uh, some, some stuff for the house. Okay. Open. Okay. If I die, oh, I saw food, man. I saw so. Mm -hmm. Niet? Is this sterk? I think it's a well. Okay. But it doesn't in the house, because it brings ongeluk. <laughs> Don't know about that. You know. So, guys, my girlfriend just came here actually about a month ago 
because her city went into lockdown so uh, she could uh, she couldn't do anything so luckily she just came in back here to chill with me which I'm very happy um, uh, but so we've been living here in Chigali just doing not much seeing that my work has not started yet she is not working either so it has been quite some fun so today we're doing some shopping not my specialty but definitely is hers don't blame me for anything <laughs> <laughs> okay let's uh, let's continue shopping okay so we're going to the second floor or oh, first floor depending if you're using american english or uk english I hope now you understand why I call this the IKEA of Rwanda. Can they hang up? Okay, Mister. CEO mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, how, how much is that? 700,000 Can you afford it? Okay, I'll buy it for your birthday <laughs> Then I'll take it home with you mm -hmm. Look like a boss. <laughs> yeah, all right. This is more than our rent combined. Carne. Mm -hmm. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. We need something to store our clothes. It's not a store. It's, how do you call it in English? <laughs> Embossment. Washing basket. Nee, and, um, really, wait a minute, what? How do you call a in English? Something like this. This is not Oh, it's kaput? Yeah. Why is it broken? Oh, but the other one beneath it? <laughs> ah, also broken. Oh, small damage. Oh. Uh, That's yeah. a huge damage. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, this one then, that is. You can see this one. That's a plastic. It is. It's not huh? Yeah. And it's wit? Or black? No, yeah, white or black. Oh, yeah. This could fit here. How much is it? 23k. 23k? Yeah. Is it worth it? Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. So? Yeah. But the lid is white, though. No, they can put a. This. Right? Yeah. Are we taking it away? Yeah, we can take this one, yeah. This one hasn't been touched yet. Okay. Like me. So, where is the? Yeah, then we only need to clean the lid, not the whole thing. Okay. It's for dirty clothing anyway. Uh -huh. Let's continue the search. So we got the. How do you call this in English? The stroller. <laughs> the kruiwagen. Kinderwagen. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on. Come on, Hello, Rendezvous people. So, <laughs> it's the next day. Um, so, yesterday we finished off uh, buying some stuff. 
Uh, it was a bit hectic, that's why I could not really film everything, but um, oh well, we got what we needed. So now today we're gonna continue our random vlog day. We're gonna be visiting some uh, plots, um, but it's kind of like raining-ish, so don't know how that's gonna go, but we'll We got an umbrella. Wait, we bought an umbrella, <laughs> so maybe it will help. We shall see. Alright, come along guys. By the time of this recording, the whole gym situation was very insecure and uh, actually the way it is uh, right now. Gyms were closed for eight months and there were no signs of opening up. Even though the gyms uh, got opened um, for only two weeks and then they closed again. Due to COVID-19, my gym location where I'm at uh, is not very secure whether I'm going to stay there or not. So I went shopping uh, with these professional brokers of mine for some uh, commercial real estate uh, elsewhere. Basically, I was just scouting, looking. Uh, I'm looking for something specific, mainly like a, a warehouse, you know. But the real estate in Kigali is not cheap. Luckily, these guys were good at it. They brought me to three, no, four different locations actually, which are all really high potential. Uh, personally, I'm even open to uh, buy or rent a, an empty plot of land and then build uh, some kind of warehouse gym over there. If you know CrossFit, you know that the gyms are not fancy. All the quality goes into the training. So many of these locations are really undeveloped. They will need some tweaking here and there, but that's all right. But I just needed to see and have like a plan B going forward because this whole COVID-19 situation is making everybody feel insecure. Hopefully this will be over soon and then we shall know more. But as of now, the gyms are still closed here in Rwanda, so is mine. Hopefully, in 2021, things will be much better, and then uh, we shall see. I'll keep you updated. So, FYI, I did not pick any locations yet. I'm still in, I'm still in negotiation and calculating everything. I'm still open to like an investor if someone wants to invest with me in maybe like buying the plot of land and I build the gym over there. But um, it's all future plans. All right, let's continue with the vlog. And then, a few days later, this happened. Three, two, and happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear heart. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. My beautiful girlfriend Talise turned twenty five. Initially she, was not, uh, initially, she was not going to stay this long until her birthday, but because of the whole lockdown situation, she stayed longer, which I was Are happy about. Yeah. Okay, uh, so, we went on uh, to celebrate it together. Happy birthday! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> you slept! Oh, you Yes, happy birthday! Of course it's vegan. What is this? Oh, it's a cake. Mm-hmm. Why did you get it? Want a Yeah. Okay, I can't you make a wish? Yeah. Hurra! <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Rest the hand. Hello, wonderful peoples. As you can see, it's uh, about a week later. And it's her birthday. Oh, wait, wait. Is it still the same vlog? It's still the same vlog, yes. <laughs> we have not finished yet. Okay. Yeah, so guys, vlogging has been quite challenging, but we're still continuing. <laughs> Today is Saturday, Delis' birthday. Yesterday we decided to do something very spontaneous, just go outside of Chigali. So, um, yeah, that's what we're doing right now. So, <laughs> let's get this journey started. Thank you, Elm.
we are on our way to Karongi. Uh, right now, I've been driving for about uh, one and a half hour. Got the uh, halfway of the road to go. So, we are celebrating Delicious birthday, and it's our first time celebrating a birthday in a warm country. Anyway, um, see you when we get there. The road trip was quite long. We went to Karonji, to Komoro's Lodge. Um, I must say the road there, yeah, a part of it is still under construction, so there were lots of potholes, really made it uncomfortable. But yo, Rwanda is full up in development, man. Uh, we saw many landscapes that I've never seen before, and also these trees which were like burnt black. Does anyone know why they do that? It looked quite fascinating. want to take some pictures. You need to tell them of what course. you did yesterday. Because you make half vlogs. Oh yeah, yeah. So yesterday we just went to town to check it out. It was not very interesting. We just had some dinner there. It was boring. And then... Uh, we had cheap dinner for like 1k. <laughs> yes. We had cheap dinner and then uh, we came back. I had uh, like a cocktail for our birthday. I'm actually pretty tired. <laughs> went to bed pretty early. But we woke up very early like 6 a.m. just automatically anyway here is the the breakfast here is some advanced stuff huh? like, how about with brown egg though because it's my birthday we <laughs> okay <laughs> So guys, we're heading towards the end of the vlog. Thank you very much for watching. Here, of course, we have to take some pictures for the birthday girl. The amount of effort that girls will go through just to take beautiful pictures, eh? Anyway, give this video a like for the list and for the effort. And don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Support me on Patreon if you can. All links in the description below. And I'll see you in the next video. Okay, ready? Ready? <laughs> the spiders! I'm not ready. I'm going to make it sexy now. Okay, what the <laughs> And then, a few days later, this happens.